as great a game Valorant is, it isn't perfect and runs into issues from time to time. My name is Yudula, you're watching Candidor Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can fix Valorant stuck on the loading screen. So if you're having problems with Valorant getting stuck on the loading screen, one of the first things that you can do is um, head over to the directory where the game is installed. So uh, in my case, uh, the E drive, then Riot Games, then Valorant, then Live, and uh, delete these two manifest files. Just simply select them, right click, delete. Uh, what this does is that it deletes uh, the in-game settings cache and Valorant will regenerate these files when you restart the game. Uh, which reminds me, the first thing you do, that you do when you experience such an error is to actually simply try restarting the game. Uh, another possible cause of Valorant getting stuck on the loading screen is uh, your system resources not being enough for the game to run. So to check that, right click, go to task manager, right click the start menu actually and uh, just make sure that uh, no processes, uh, no unnecessary processes are running. So if let's say you find uh, Valorant running in this list, just select it and click the end task button and then restart the game. Updating your graphics cards drivers are also very important. So uh, just open GeForce Experience. Yeah, and uh, check for any graphics card driver updates that might be available. So under the drivers tab, uh, as you can see, I have an update available. So try updating your GPU drivers, whether you have uh, Nvidia, AMD, or even if you have Intel drivers are also very important for the game stability. And then comes your internet connection. Uh, make sure you don't have any active VPNs running. So you shouldn't have any VPN connections and uh, uh, just make sure that you're connected to the internet and working. One more thing that you should be on the lookout for if Valorant is not launching uh, is corrupt game files. So to fix that, let's open the Riot client. So I'll uh, just search for Riot client. You can search for it in your start menu or in the Windows search bar. Uh, wait for the client to open up. Give it a second. Click your profile icon right here and then click settings select valorant from the list and just hit this repair button uh, let it do its thing and uh, once the setup uh, is complete when it has repaired all the files the game should automatically boot up uh, other than this if repairing game files doesn't work what you can do is you can force valorant to reinstall vanguard to do that, just right click the Windows Start menu and click on Installed Apps. Give it a second. Yeah, search for Vanguard. Yeah, and just click these buttons and click Uninstall. So the next time you launch Valorant, it will try and reinstall Vanguard again. It will show up as an update and that should fix the problem. Another thing that you can do if Valorant is not loading is to try and launch the game as an administrator. So uh, just go to the binary folder where the game's file is located. Um, right click valorant.exe and click properties. Now you'll see a few options here, but head over to the compatibility tab and make sure that uh, run this program in as an administrator is selected. Uh, you can also disable full screen optimizations if, um, as that can sometimes cause problems with the game not launching but uh, regardless select these two settings uh, or either one of them you can try out their combinations click apply and uh, try running the game again as a last resort if nothing else works your best bet is to completely reinstall the game from scratch and then try again if you like these videos, consider subscribing, give us a thumbs up, press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such content can we make for you. If you want to know more about tech, visit our website candid.technology, follow us on social media, follow me on Instagram or Twitter and we'll see you in the next video.